Hi everybody, I'm Sarah and this is POP17. Pulling stunts is one way to create a store online and many people have used momentum off of a single video to launch their entire careers. Hi, I'd like to get a spicy chicken chalupa, please. Hi. Yeah, my doctor, please? Yeah. Let me get your license plate number first. Hold on. We want a happy meal, sir. I was pretty psyched about that one, and it certainly made the rounds. But as you can see, I'm not still working with my Transformer headgear. I just wanted to draw attention to Robo Rights. Tokyo Stormtrooping Dancer? That's another story. Before even drawing attention to the outfit and dancing it up in the streets of Japan, more than likely, the Tokyo Stormtrooper knew he was onto a hit. And as they say, when something works, do it again, and again. I can imagine this could lead to some merchandising, but how far can you take this idea without building upon it? One interesting case study is the Coke and Mentos guys. Just like Tokyo Stormtroopers, they did it again, and again. But they also wound up on a conference circuit, a festival circuit, and now they even have their own patent for their own Coke and Mentos trigger bottle cap thingamajiggy. Improv Everywhere is a famous performance art crew in New York, best known for their remarkable social engineering stunts, often utilizing hundreds of volunteers. Still in Grand Central was a recent performance that gained the most reach. Showing up to Best Buy in store uniform colors was a popular one. Here's one where they're filling up the windows of DSW. Where are they now? Charlie Todd of Improv Everywhere is represented by Generate, which is in the news this week for raising $6 million. In a parallel world, Improv Everywhere is a lot like a hit-making machine in the music world. While the art of music is not just about hits, on the business side of things, a hit factory can drive valuable traffic to sales, so there's a lot of demand. One thing most of the greatest stunts have in common is planning. The combination of planning a video, making it funny or amazing, and capturing unexpected reactions is a regular formula that has been used successfully time and time again. This is a topic that I'll be spending a lot of time talking about, so if you have any comments, jump right in. Oh, <laughs>